What's up guys, welcome back to the Bottoms Up Review channel. We got Bud Light seltzers and truly hard seltzers. We got both Christmas packs. So we're gonna do like a little face off today, see who does it better. Mm -hmm. So on the right. truly side here, we have spiked apple spice. We have the pomegranate ginger fizz. Cran orange sparkler, all right. And then we got holiday sangria style. All right, sounds interesting. Okay, this is probably even more interesting. We got seltzer nog, like seltzer nog. Okay, hopefully it's a little bit like eggnog. I like eggnog. Cherry cordial, 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 cordial. I thought so. That's what I said, right? Cordial. And then cranberry. Oh, just cranberry. And then sugar plum, sugar plum, sugar plum, sugar plum. Sugar plum. Nice. Yeah. All right. All right. So let's get into it. Which one do you want to start out with? Rock paper scissors. Rock, paper, scissors? Yep, yep. All right. Rock, Rock paper, scissors, scissors, shoot. All right. All right. Go ahead, go um, ahead. I want to start off with the nog. All right, that sounds really yeah. interesting. Yeah, it does. Start it off hot. Oh, yeah. Okay. Ooh, it smells kind of like oatmeal. That's what I'm getting. Well, how much you got in there? Just about half, right? Hey, bubble, give me some more bubble. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Hey, go, don't, skip don't skip out on me. Don't skip out on me. trying to get me drunk. <laughs> This smell like oatmeal? Oof. Yeah. It smells. It's like almost like the um the Quaker uh apple oatmeal. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Very interesting smell. Yeah. That is very cool. Alright, let's give her a taste. Okay. It has a very oatmeal taste to me for some reason. It's not terrible. I don't dislike it. No, it's pretty good. It, it I get like a the cinnamon from the eggnog, but it's not a super strong cinnamon. Right. It doesn't taste like very noggy to me. Very almost like cinnamon apple oatmeal for some reason. Yeah, that's right. that's exactly what it tastes like. Like even those little chunks of apple in there for some reason. I like it. I mean, hmm. yeah, that's not terrible. I don't yeah. dislike it. I don't like it though. Yeah, I'd say I'm somewhere in the middle. Yeah. So start now. We'll just sit it there in the middle. Yeah, it's definitely going in the middle right there. I'd say taste on a scale of one to ten. Six and a half, seven? Yeah, that's six and a half, seven, maybe. I was gonna say a seven. Seven's the very yeah. highest right there, probably. It's not terrible, but no, yeah, definitely not something I want to get drunk on. Okay. Ooh. All right. All right. Let's move on to one of the truly. Yeah, so what do you want to do next? Um, cran orange. orange. I want to see what that's about. Hopefully, this doesn't. Look the flavor. Do all that out there. Ooh, I'm, I'm kind of right, I think. It smells like the... Kind of like orange green. It's all right. I like that. It's not... It's a little sweet. Cover all nine times of these ones. It's a little on the sweet side, but that's just truly. Like, truly's in general are just yeah. more sweeter seltzers. But it's not too sweet because they they got like the truly punches. I hate that shit. Yeah. It's too sweet. They're really bad. But they're like almost almost just a little too sweet. But but it's it's doable. Pretty good. I'm thinking somewhere around seven and a half to eight. Probably probably somewhere in there. I'd probably give it. I'd give, give it seven, seven and a half. half. Yeah, seven yeah, and a half. Yeah, sure, seven yeah. and a half. Eight at the max. I'd say it's definitely better than the nog one. Oh yeah. Not by very much. Mm -hmm. They're both really good. Uh -huh. But I. I exactly prefer it. Yeah. Yeah. If you want something a little sweeter, you're going with the yeah, you're going with the truly there. Set that up there. Uh, <laughs> all right. I don't know if I'll be able to chug all of these. <sighs> oh boy. All right. Um, back over to Bud Light. Yes, sir. Cherry cordial, cranberry, and sugar plum. I want to try that sugar plum. Me too. That's what I was thinking. So. <sighs> What? He gave himself about a quarter of the can. I didn't mean to. I'm trying. I was trying to make it half. He's trying to get me drunk. I'm trying to get you drunk. Yeah. You got some studying to do. I'm trying to help you out with that. It just smells sweet. I don't know what it smells like though. It smells like like uh, women's like body spray almost. Okay. Like it, yeah. it smells like if you like walked mm -hmm. into a Bath and Body Works during Christmas. That's what it smells Kinda, like. Kinda yeah. Like during the holiday. Hmm. Uh, no, not liking that. It kind of tastes like, you're definitely over there. It kind of tastes like perfume, not gonna lie. Yeah. We might have to dump these out. Bubble. Yeah, I do not want to finish this. I am not chugging it. Oh, that is gross. 
It's not the worst thing I've ever had. It's 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 not great though. It's mm. it's solid. drinkable. Mm -hmm. Not oh. chuggable, just the flavor. Would, I would not want to drink that. No, that is kind of shitty. All right, you want me to dump? Yeah, this? Dump All right. this out. Pick the next yeah. one out while I dump. Time this. out here. We're going pomegranate ginger fizz. Ooh, that sounds pretty fancy. interesting. Yeah. Ugh. Right. Yeah, don't be skipping out on that. All right, all right, my bad. It smells very fruity, and at the end, it smells like kind of like. Right? It has a very interesting smell. It does. It's very distinct. It doesn't smell anything like the sugar plum, mm -hmm. but it still smells like, like that body spray sort of. Dude, that's exactly what I was going to say for sure. It smells very sweet. Yeah. And then you have like that body spray kind of thing at the end, like yeah. the perfumey. Yeah. For some reason, it has a lot of... It's not very flavorful, but you get a feeling in your mouth, right? Do You got like some kind of... It's like... It, it's more of a texture kind of thing almost. It's like... I mean, I definitely get the pomegranate and yeah. ginger. I don't like ginger, and pomegranate is meh, mm -hmm. so that's probably why I don't like it that much. But I'm thinking it's definitely better than that sugar plum. Mm -hmm. I think. Oh yeah. I think we can automatically just oh, put it all the way down yeah. the bottom. Let's just, give. Yeah, let's put some fucking space over there. Yeah. And um, I'm thinking that's right below the nog. Yeah, for opinion. sure. Promising. It almost smells like chocolate. It smells like a cherry chocolate. It smells like. Now, what is a cordial? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe we should have uh, done a little research before the video. So, a cordial just means warm and friendly. Oh, medicine. A cordial is any invigorating and stimulating preparation that is intended for a medicinal purpose. So that means it's healthy to drink this. That's healthy. Yeah, gluten free, yeah. by the way. All of these. <laughs> yeah. It even has like a little it's, color. Dude, to dude it. you know what it tastes? Like? I know. I I just just this just tapped into my memories. It smells like fucking tootsie rolls. Yeah, like, it does. Those thick ass tootsie rolls that you get like when, yeah. you're, when you're going Halloween shopping. Yeah. Not hop, you're going trick or treating. Uh, no, I'm not. <laughs> uh, it smells exactly like a tootsie roll. It almost tastes like one. It really does. That taste. It that is. That is so cool. It doesn't even really taste like cherry. It just tastes. Mm -hmm. Just even the even the aftertaste. It's just tootsie roll, man. Like those those really thick ones, they're like yeah. that round, and then they're yeah. like that one. Those are my favorite one. That is very cool. That is a very cool drink. Not gonna lie. Yeah. I now would you say it's yeah. better than the the orange sparkler one? That's tough. That's I know it's better. Than the nog, yeah. I don't know which side it's gonna go. It's it's great. It's interesting. It's so different that I want to put it in front of there. Yeah, right. But I didn't enjoy it as much. But again, I think it should get like bonus points for how cool it is. You know, something like that because yeah. it's it's yeah, that's something. Cool. It's it's very interesting. I I don't know how to describe it. I think yeah. it still goes below the truly. Okay. But yeah. I mean, but above the nog, mm -hmm. obviously. Yeah. But it's still like a very good drink. It's a oh, I think great. It, I think it's almost a contender with the truly. Honestly. Right. Right. Like yeah, I think I said eight for this one. Seven and a half, eight. This one is definitely not eight. It's like seven, seven and a half. So it is a contender. Like it can compete with it. Yeah. Because it could hit that seven and a half spot. Yeah. So it's yeah. Yeah, I did enjoy it though. It's very interesting. Hey, right, quick time out. Send up your prayers for us because this is the carbonations getting a little shifty here. I want to try this apple spice one, but the sangria uh -huh. sounds really good. Yeah. Not gonna lie. No, yeah, let's go ahead then. All right, let's go for this. Awesome. One. I, I still have that tootsie roll in my mouth. It's yeah, yeah. There we go. I feel better. Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> you pour all that shit out on once. <laughs> Hold on a second. Here, give me some of that. Yeah, just pour some. <laughs> yeah. I, I forgot yeah, we were having these for a second, and I was about to pour the entire thing. Are you, are you drunk? A uh, little bit. Okay, cool. No. It smells good. It smells like fruit punch. It does. Yeah, that's exactly what it smells like. Yeah. Well, that's Not even like the fruit punch flavoring, like artificial fruit punch stuff. Yeah. Actual fruit punch. Like well, the ones you make at parties yeah. and shit. 
Like, like you drop the seven up in there and everything. It smells exactly like that. Well, I believe that's what sangria is. Like I don't know exactly what you mix with it, what type of like lit alcohol. Mm -hmm. But typically you use just like a bunch of different fruits, so it's almost like a. Oh, okay. Bunch. I didn't know exactly what a sangria was, to be honest. So. I, I believe I could be wrong. It yeah. looked like just a. a <laughs> they got like a just look like picture. A just yeah, just different yeah. different stuff on there. I don't know. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Uh, it's good at first, and then it it tastes like if you uh, dropped a stick of cinnamon into a can of fruit punch. I don't yeah. know why they would do that. Or fireball. If you were like making a fireball yeah, and like yeah. fruit punch kind of thing, it even it's very warm too, isn't it? It has a very warm texture to it for some reason. I don't, I don't like it. I don't. I don't think it's. I don't know if it's worse than the sugar plum one though or not. I like I to like be fair, I, I like hate, cinnamon stuff I, though. I, that's the thing. I yeah. hate cinnamon. Right. But I, I know. You, yeah. But even even me, like I I love Fireball and like cinnamon shit. Like that's yeah, me. And right. then even I'm not impressed by this at all. Okay, I, after like getting a few more drinks of it, like it's it kind of mild. It's, it's yeah, milding it's out. It's definitely yeah. like mm. not as cinnamon. Right. Cinnamon. -y. Cinnamon. -y. Cinnamon. 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 -y. Cinnamon. -y. An enemy. An enemy. An enema. An enema. The enigma. It does taste more like coupons every time you try it. Yeah. So maybe it was just that initial taste. Like I still get that hint of cinnamon, but it's super fruit punch straightforward. Yeah, for sure. I um, like it. I like it more now that we're drinking yeah. it. It's definitely going above sugar plum in my opinion. Would now. you say it's above the other truly? Yeah, that's a sugar plum, is it? No, that's no, a that's a, Oh my bad, my bad. But yeah, the sugar that's, plum. Yeah, definitely above this one. Um, yeah, but they're both purple. They're both purple. I don't know. <laughs> um, I don't know. All right, I'm going I'm to finish it, and then I'll be able to tell you here real quick. It's, yeah, it's like six and a half, seven. It's like that seven range. I will say this one is probably the best for chugging. Mm-hmm. Because it's Cause very, it's not warm. It's not very, well, like, carbonation-y. Well, also, whenever you're chugging it, I don't get that cinnamon flavor. Yeah. It's, I only get the fruit punches of going down. Right. But once I've finished the chug, I get that hint of cinnamon. Yeah, yeah I see what you mean. Like, when it's not sitting in your mouth. Yeah, yeah for sure. That's, that's, yeah, I think I do want to put it right after that nog, I think. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta set it back Got us, Get a nice right. view for you, yeah. All right. We're on to our last Bud Light Seltzer, the cranberry uh, one. Cranberry, okay. mm, I'm not impressed by it. It smell. smells just like cranberry juice. Like you, does it? I don't even think it does. It smells just like cranberry juice. Like I can't even really smell like alcohol or well, obviously there's seltzers. You're mm. not really gonna smell alcohol, but like it just smells like. I sm it's very seltzery. You have a lot of the seltzer flavor. That like, one, not is seltzer flavor, but like the texture of yeah. like normal, like just. Um, carbonated waters yeah. and stuff like that and then you get like a hint of cranberry kind of like yeah. a white claw this is definitely the most like seltzer seltzer right out of all of right these. the most seltzer kind of thing yeah like, kind of like white claws they advertise them as like you know like it's it's a seltzer it's a spiked seltzer with a hint of mango or something like that yeah. this is the closest thing to that yeah. so if you like white claws i would recommend something like that for sure yeah. because it's not super fruity until the end yeah i mean I don't hate it. I'm. I don't dislike it either. I'm surprised. I did. I didn't think I was gonna like it. Right now, I'm looking at in between the nog and the sangria. That, no. that, oh, I was going. I was gonna go between I the two. Yeah, that's, that's what I was thinking. That's what I'm thinking right now. Mm -hmm. Also, now that I mm -hmm. think about it again, mm -hmm. I could make an argument possibly for between them, but that would be like if we went back and tried them again and was like, yeah, yeah. we really wanted it to do all that. Mm -hmm. But initially, my first thought was between those two. Yeah. Truly, is there? Right. And the pomegranate. Yeah, that's my opinion. That. Yeah. All right. So, like, yeah. if you think about it, like, you you're used to a lot of cranberry, and I'm not. Yeah. And even even both of us decided that it was in that yeah. spot as well. So I mean, like, yeah. I, I feel like that's not. Let's get it. Uh, yeah, let's finish it. All right, let's let's end on a good note. We got spiked apple spice. So right, thinking, it does have yeah. the cinnamon on it, so it's probably just it's, it's going to be like an apple pie flavor, mm -hmm. probably. So if this one doesn't taste like. Uh, apple oatmeal and the other one did I'll be very confused because because that all that nog I was talking about it tasted a lot like hold on a sec I like the smell it's very fruity very green apple -y. oh yeah like a green apple not like normal mm. yeah kind of yeah. I don't get any cinnamon on the smell 
Yeah. No, on the smell, no, there's definitely no cinnamon. Yeah. Very appley. Yeah. very... And then it finishes with the cinnamon. It tastes just like apple pie filling. For sure. Wow. Yeah. That's definitely going to be my top two. Yeah, for sure. I don't know about uh, you, but... Before the sangria, for sure. So top top four, without a doubt. I think, personally, mm -hmm. I like it better than the nog. Okay. I think I might like it better than the cherry. Okay. But I don't know if I like it better. I wish we would have saved some so I could have tasted it again. Right. But... It does taste like apple pie. If you like cinnamon, this is this is good. It, you don't even like. It's not a super strong cinnamon. It's like very very mm -hmm. like small hint of cinnamon. Like mm -hmm. this one, the holiday sangria had a lot more cinnamon flavor to it. For sure, there. yeah, definitely. It almost like smacked you in the face. Almost. Yeah. This one's like it's it's a smooth finish almost. Like you you got that fresh apple and it's like a nice smooth finish with that cinnamon like a like a like an apple pie. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm. um, so what do you think for that? Where do you want to put that? Curly's. You know what? Let's do this. I will say we will stack put, it up there. We'll yeah. put it as a tie. Okay. Well, hold on. Let me make it aesthetically yeah. aesthetically pleasing to the eye. Aesthetically pleasing. Uh-huh. So what I'm thinking is if you like apple pie, like green apple flavored stuff, mm -hmm. you will 100% like that more. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, this one is more like an, the, the bottom one, the truly, yeah. uh, the orange, mm -hmm. what is it, cran orange? Yeah, cran orange, yep. If, if you like like that uh, orange cream sort of stuff. Yeah, like me, yeah, like us, yeah. I was more inclined to choose that one. I that think. one will probably be your favorite out of everything. Right, right. There's I, So my personal opinion, the way I look at it is the Bud Light Seltzers tasted more like seltzers than the Trulies did. Right, right. The Trulies tasted a little more sweet than your traditional seltzer. Right, for sure. And but but if you think about it, if you uh, if you have something sweeter and you still kind of end at the if you still finish at the end, mm -hmm. it's kind of like what are you doing? You know what I mean? Yeah, right. So so it, you can make the argument that like they're just doing something wrong. Yeah. yeah or right. we just don't like those specific flavors right, for some yeah. reason. Yeah. So like I, I'm thinking. I'm trying to be objective because yeah. I, I'm inclined to not like Truly, just because I've had I've had some bad memories with Truly punches, to be honest. Yeah. And but I still want to say Truly came out on top. That's my opinion. I'm gonna say uh, Truly wins. Personally, for me, Truly mm. wins this. Yeah. Just because I don't like typical seltzers where it's like a seltzer right. that it tastes like some sort of fruit. Right. For sure. And that's what Bud Light seltzers typically taste like. Yeah. Kind of like that white claw kind of thing. Yeah, but, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I don't want to say go out and get the Trulies. Mm -hmm. um, if you like the typical seltzers, then you should mm -hmm. go for the Bud Lights. Right. If you like something a little more uh, sweet, a little more like actual flavor, mm -hmm. I would go for the Trulies. For sure, yeah. And that's how I see it. Mm -hmm. Some flavor to it, like like the like obviously like the spiked apple. It's got some flavor to it. You yeah. Know? Or the cran orange. It's gonna be like that cran orange flavor, obviously. Yeah. Um, I'm not, I don't dislike White Claws and those kind of seltzer things, even though before I started drinking, I didn't like carbonated waters and things like that, but it's just, it's just, it's just different. It depends on what you're looking for, but if you're, if you're trying to be objective like we are right now, the truly is going to come out on top, I think. Yeah. For sure. I feel like if anybody else did this, this it's going to be pretty close to this right here. Yeah. Just because like, even though, even though they're super sweet, a couple of them came out at the bottom. But like, you get that extra points for having those two really good ones, I think. Yeah. But I, th I feel like you can make the, the case either way almost, but I'm gonna have to go with Truly. Yeah. 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 So, all right, sounds good. Well, <laughs> you heard it here first, folks. Truly. Truly. Is the winner. Over Bud Light, which is unfortunate. I was hoping Bud Light would come out top, but yep. Love rocks. Love rocks, baby. Love rocks, baby. Bird Boy's out. <laughs>